It's your man, I make mad beats live from outer space and unapologetic studio. We're here with another episode of Tight Beat. Um, yeah, it's gonna be interesting. Behind me is my cast, unique period. <laughs> See, major kid maestro, yeah, yeah. We're gonna have an interesting discussion tonight or today or this evening or this afternoon. What's the topics? So we're talking about uh, Kendrick, uh, Kendrick's uh, return back into um, controversial rap. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> um, controversial rap. Controversial uh, we're talking about uh, file loss, right? We talk about our journeys, whether or not uh, no story, horror stories, basically. Um, and yeah, and we also, what do we decide? Are are they um, our official instrumentals coming back? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Do we ever, will we ever get the? Yeah, that's a good. Mm. One. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Well, let's start it off. I feel like there's an obvious one to start it off with. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Talking about K. The hottest yeah. topic on the internet right now. K. Damn K. Yeah. Um, I Maestro thought his verse was absolute fire. <laughs> nah. And murders all rappers <laughs> in the history of rap. He thought that that was the great. Didn't you? Didn't what he said? He said it was the greatest diss <clears throat> in the history of the word diss, and that we yeah. should change the word to a better word <laughs> because this no longer is good <laughs> enough. Yeah. Now, I definitely, I definitely didn't say that, but <laughs> I, I, I woke up. So I listened to it this morning, like upon first waking up, and um, my immediate thoughts was like. Man, it's it's just dope that this conversation is happening. First of all, so I mean, we're, at the end of the day, like I feel like this is going to continue because Kendrick, Drake, and J Cole have never been the ones to just you know sit back and and just not respond or say these things. So I feel like this is going to be a kind of an ongoing situation. Um, yeah. And then it it kind of got me into like the the history of all this so i watched a couple videos on on the history of drake um dissing uh kendrick lamar and vice versa and j cole dissing 
Kendrick Lamar and vice versa. And I feel like this has been going on for a while. Like this, this to me at first, it seemed just kind of like only out of because a first person shooter. But I think this has kind of just been, there's been some tensions, you know what I'm saying? Like, I think there's, there's been tensions. Uh, Kendrick, I mean, J Cole, like clearly just feeling like, you know, his whole career, like, Despite being one of the the best lyricists out there, you know what I'm saying, to be putting out music, has been consistently being put under Drake and Kendrick Lamar in every single conversation. Definitely mentioned in the top three, but never, I've never heard anybody say, yo, J. Cole is is smashing Paul's, either one of those two. (laughs) Either one of those two, you know what I'm saying? You never heard nobody say that in 2023? I'm saying saying prior to, to, to like, really this year. Yeah. It's, okay, yeah. it's 2024, just to be clear. Yeah. Okay, but go ahead. Yeah, yeah. yeah. So you're saying before 2024, you never heard nobody say that statement? That, yeah, that J. Cole was a better rapper yeah, than Kendrick? I was, never. I, I hear more I've Cole hate that than before. anything. Yeah. I hear I hear Cole boring. Like, I hear more. Even mm-hmm. even when he be smacked, like the Yachty Junk, I be hearing a whole lot of Cole hate. I hear more Cole hate than I hear Kendrick hate, for sure. And, and Kendrick ain't drop shit in forever. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I hear love on both ends. Like I hear the hate for you know Cole saying that he he rap he rap boring and stuff like that or whatnot. But then I hear niggas saying like you know uh, Cole killing Kendrick or whatnot. Yeah, I, I hear niggas be, uh, saying Kendrick killing Cole. I feel like it's your listening circle. Like yeah, if you if you around like I guess more substance um, value in people, that's probably what you hear. Yeah, I hear a lot of the opposite though. Yeah. I mean, except for when I'm around, yeah. like all the rappers I chill with are like the rapping is lyricist rappers. Yeah. Ever. yeah, I'll leave it at that. I'm gonna let you go ahead and continue. Go ahead. Yeah, so yeah. It just it, I th- that was honestly more fascinating, like how we get how we got to this point than the actual joint. Now, as far as the verse itself, um, okay. Damn. Now I I never really had a chance to speak on this, mm. but it. When it came to first person shooter, right? Now I've, I've been very much enjoying what J Cole has been doing. That man has came back and is is really smacking the industry, and that's I love that energy. That's what he does. But my reaction to that verse is kind of the same reaction I had to this verse, which which was the most important thing was I'm excited that this co- competitive energy is happening. Right? To me, there was. There was like shots taken at at Kendrick, right? But you know what I'm saying? I didn't think that verse in particular in particular was like, you know, crazy. And I feel like this one, I feel like Kendrick's junt, he definitely had some lines, some stuff that went over my head that after I seen it be dissected, I was like, oh damn, that was, that was clever, right? But upon first listening, I was just kind of like, okay. It was it was like this is the beginning, right? Let's start. You know, I know you mentioned uh earlier name, like this junk compared to control. I mean, I mean, ain't no said ver- it was pretty much yeah, trash. Ain't, ain't no like, verse, comp- you know. What I'm saying it's definitely, it's, it's definitely not. Yeah, it's, it's definitely what not is. scathing or direct or just as aggressive as that junk um, at all. So it's it's definitely no comparison. But honestly, I'm waiting. <laughs> I'm waiting for Drake to say something directly because. One thing I did really enjoy is I just enjoy I enjoyed like and this is just like something I have for Kendrick. I enjoyed hearing Kendrick rap. Yeah. Like yeah. the way yeah. like yeah. it's like it's it's enjoyable to listen to. Yeah. I feel like Drake has that similar like ability where when Drake says something, it's also gonna be just like like fun to listen to. You know what I mean? I feel like when Kendrick drops verses, they they have like lyrics and it's also just like they they sit in that in like that kind of both world situation yeah. where I feel like J Cole, you know, not, not to take away from like his actual lyricism in the bars that he's spitting, they definitely top tier, but he doesn't really have that particular factor, which is why I'm very interested to see Drake say something because you know what I'm saying? His John is also going to be a hit. I felt like, you know, Kendrick did his thing or oh, not. I felt like he delivered it um, as Kendrick would, but um, at the same time, like when we was breaking it down earlier, I do understand how like old Kendrick, like the 
damn album kendrick control kendrick he comes with like all these different levels of voices and shit like that like he gives us artistry in his music yeah. it was just felt like he was just rapping on this one i, I mean i'm thinking about verses like he did on the push a t joint like to me <laughs> like that shit is mm-hmm. like yeah. you know what i'm saying and yeah. Yeah. i don't feel like drake or j cole like has like has had verses that impact me the way like a verse like that has. Yeah. This yeah. This joint really feel like he got some more shit in the like. I feel like he waiting on a nigga to say something. Man. He got what y'all bit, talking man, about. This a build up. Yeah. Like I really and, and niggas just beat me. Like that's the audacity for a nigga to say some shit like that after the run that both of these niggas been on and he been on the island is just fucking crazy. And he really ain't been on. Like he, this nigga been torn and the tour's been going mm-hmm. fucking crazy. Yeah. Like niggas is chanting Ole 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 yeah. Kendrick. Like he really on some god shit. Like he really feel like like nigga got the crown with the thorns. Like he really feel like he on it. It's like that shit. That, I don't think. I don't think this was like a deep dive. This was just like a shot. <laughs> it was like a warning shot. Like, all right, and pull up. Like, I got some more shit too. Like, bro, he he absolutely does not respect Drake at all. At all. I don't he think he respect none of the people. Well, I don't, I, don't, I, I, say, I don't think he respect. I do think he respect Cole. He respect Cole for sure, for sure. I think I think he may have used to respect the Drake, but ever since I feel like he was one of the people that got sucked in to like. <laughs> When <laughs> yeah. 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 swallowed up, <laughs> swallowed, <laughs> no <laughs> um, uh, I feel like he was one of the people that like really, like when the whole like Quentin Miller stuff happened. Like I feel like he yeah, already there. didn't 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 really respect Drake, which I think is wild. I feel like the way. Over the years, after seeing like the the video that I watched this morning, the way Kendrick be i don't know i feel like he should have some more more respect for drake because that nigga drake really put him on you know what i'm saying like the nigga had his first big show in his own city because of drake like so yeah yeah i don't i don't know but yeah, drake yeah. put kendrick, <laughs> drake no, put kendrick I, on bro he, <laughs> no, drake put kendrick on, but he, he did have a party he had, yeah, bro he had a saying. big fam I feel, like Drake, I feel like if anybody Drake put Kendrick, yeah, Kendrick like up. I would say Wait, I feel like Drake had Drake, Drake gave, gave him the part. stage. Bruh. Drake gave him probably Fam. the biggest stage he had ever been. It on. was it was off of it was off of that tour that Drake pulled him in on that that he released Good Kid Mad City. Now I, I Good Kid Mad City was a phenomenal album on his own. You know what I'm saying? But like you just can't deny like he he admitted himself he was rocking shows for 2000 and now it's five figure people in the crowd because of drake for the first time you know what i'm saying and you know drake has some lines about sunning him in his own city you know what i'm saying over the years but i feel like i feel like once that junk came out like it really was like that's when he started saying me and drake is just two different junks and i feel like he was one of them people that like meek mill just dissed him first like i feel like he was waiting on drake to say something so he can bring that out and i feel like Push a T beat him to the punch too. Like I feel like cause you know he had them lines about but please say my name so I can end your career. And you know what I'm saying? I feel like he knew about Drake's son before, you know what I'm saying, when Drake was hiding his world from the kid. <laughs> Man, I had the world. Like, you been hiding the kid. <laughs> had a kid, you hiding a kid from the world. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I feel like this is just J. Cole. I feel like Kendrick Lamar respects J. Cole and like Kendrick is just excited to be able to take more disrespectful shots at Drake. <laughs> so, yeah. Anyway, yeah. What you I think? Feel, honestly, and it's disappointing. I just want to say this: it's disappointing. As much as I am a Kendrick fan, but after just having to really sit back, right now we'll see at the end of this conversation. I yeah. feel like Drake is still just on top of all them niggas, bro. So I don't know. <laughs> as Paul, far yeah, this as whole conversation is probably on top of all them niggas. Is crazy, like because. <laughs> Cole, Cole, Cole has been up there, but like niggas ain't re- niggas wasn't really just recognizing him like that. You know what I'm saying? Like niggas that knew was recognizing him, but like everybody wasn't like the Drake fans and stuff like that. So I do feel like once he did that first person shoot a jump with Drake, and even the one with uh, Twenty One, when uh, he finally got a fucking Grammy for that jump, I think uh, him and Twenty One got a Grammy for that one. For, a lot. Uh, 
Uh-huh. A lot? Yeah, for a lot. And um, after that, you know, niggas started bringing in Drake in more, I mean, uh, Cole in more often or whatnot. But Cole will kill anybody on their own shit and send them motherfuckers home running crying to their moms. You know what I'm saying? We'll never hear the damn song. And I, I, I like, even with First Person Shooter with him and Drake, like, I think that was a great ass verse from Cole. You know what I'm saying? Like, Drake, it's a given. You know what I'm saying? Like, whatever genre you put Drake in, like, he's going to demolish it. Kendrick, I love Kendrick. Love everything about his music. I, but it's like the more and more I think about this song, the more and more I think about this verse, I'm, 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 I'm like, literally dying a little bit inside because I'm like, damn, nigga, like, is this a, hey, like, I'm finna come for y'all if y'all say some type shit or was this all you had to bring to the table type shit? You know what I'm saying? Like, like, I I really don't. I feel like Kendrick is extremely capable of of doing something else. I know he's capable, but it's it's like this is kind of like that first impression type Mm -hmm. deal. You know what I'm saying? Right, nigga should have came harder. Yeah, like Big Paul. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. I don't even know where to start after such flagrant things have been said. <laughs> um, damn, where do I start? Uh, let me take the hoodie off for this. Let me take this off, too. I thought you was going to put the shades on. Shades were off. I took them off. Shades off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fuck your shades off. <laughs> um, man. All right, so let me just, let me just reverse engineer. Uh, like... I I think I think Drake and Kendrick have been playing footsies for forty years. You know what I'm saying? This nigga said footsies. Uh, I think they, you know, been doing little random stuff and you know little bars here and there, you know, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, and if I'm being all the way real, like I'm not really excited about. Drake versus uh, Kendrick because again like that's I don't know that feels like like Drake is never gonna step to the plate in a way that would in in my opinion see that's the difference when Nas and Jay-Z was going at it Jay is gonna step to the plate like no I'm the goat rapper like I'm about this rap I'm about this hip hop I'm about lyricism. I'm a writer. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, he's going to step up and try to defend that aspect of his career, even though Jay was so multifaceted. Jay made, had hits. Jay did a whole album with Linkin Park, damn it. You know what I'm saying? Like, Jay was the first Drake. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But but he loved rap so much that he would be like, all right, bet. Now, you challenge me on the rap side. Let's take it back to the park. But we can do that. I don't feel like Drake got that in him. And I'm saying that as a Drake fan, and I know Drake can rap. You know what I'm saying? But I don't think that, like, oh, nah, word, pet. You know what I'm saying? Like, or, or maybe, even if he does have that in him, I don't know if he has that in him for Kendrick. Because yeah, I mean, mm-hmm. I've seen him go at Common. I've seen him go at other rappers like that. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. But, but anytime it's, like, somebody who can knock him down, he d- he, yeah, you know, he yeah. kind of just do a whole bunch of this. You know what I'm saying? Bam. That's uh, <laughs> I just want to I just want to co- you know agree with you saying by like the the control verse. He was literally the only rapper name that was like, but whatever. You know, what I'm yeah. Let it be real. You know what I'm saying? All the other rappers was like, yeah, I respect it. It's it's yeah. hip hop. You know what I'm yeah. saying? It's competitive. Let's let's get it. You know what yeah. I'm saying? Yeah. And he was the he was literally the only one that was in interviews saying, but like. How you gonna say that and see me? You know what I'm saying? It'd be all love. You know what I mean? Like, how you say it? How you gonna say that, bro? I don't. You know what I'm saying? Let it, <laughs> let, it, let, it, let it be real. Let it be real. You know what I mean? Bro, Drake never said it like You know what I'm saying? Drake about to diss you with that. Like, hey, <laughs> what? Bro, Drake, please this. <laughs> yeah, I'm down with that. That would be the Drake, greatest. Let's make that happen, man. Drake, we in Memphis, bro. We right down the street. Hey, bro, y'all know how Drake moves. He gonna diss y'all. Dissing me, bro. If that gotta happen, Drake. If they gotta have him, <laughs> <laughs> hey, we can write some shit. Out of Taj and Jones, ain't afraid of a Drake, uh, of a Drake diss. <laughs> hey, Not at all. 
Period. So yeah. Anyway, but yeah. I, I'm just. I said that to say I, control was like. I agree with you, especially after how he responded to control. Yeah. And and I want to be clear. And I, I want to reiterate this. Like, I'm a Drake fan. I think Drake can really rap. I think I think because Drake does a whole bunch of sing songy stuff and has a whole bunch of pop s stuff. You know, makes people doubt his ability, but. When he show up, he show up. But for some reason, when it comes to Kendrick, he, he's he's you extra dodgy. What? You know what I'm saying? Um, <laughs> <laughs> um, now with Cole, okay. Um, now that's different. Um, Cole will take you on on Twitter. You know what I'm saying? Uh, <laughs> I saw somebody post up that as soon as Cole heard the verse. That he got on his bike and ran and just rode to the yeah, studio. <laughs> like and, and 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 that's that's what I've come to expect. Is like you know you not he is so about the craft, you know, and about the skill of it that you know, you know, and and it just depends. Like to me, I'm gonna be real. Like I feel like if this was 2018 and Kendrick sent that shot at Cole, then yeah, respond. You know what I'm saying? Um, but like. I feel like I feel like Kendrick's ascension was so fast and so gangster and J. Cole's ascension was a slow burn in comparison, right? That I think Kendrick might be delusional as to where J. Cole is right now. Mm. No, my nigga. I'm sorry. J. Cole right now J. Cole right now is 6'8", is a 6'8 point guard who is wrecking the whole league, right? You don't throw no little throwaway random, nah, dog. if you're going to diss him, diss him. You know what I'm saying? That ain't your little brother no more. That ain't something that one or two lines here or there is going to do, and they got to be cryptic and obscure. Nah, you need to bring out a control verse against this dude. Like, I don't think you understand. Like, your little robot friend has turned into Optimus Prime. Shit. Like, this ain't the same no more. You can do that with little Drake, because Drake is going to be. I told you that. Yeah. Can't Drake let my. You know, he's going to do whatever. That's Drake said now. <laughs> that was a better Drake than the other. This thing is that was kind of. But nah, I mean, like, you know, I've listened to a lot of diss. I mean, it's hip hop. You know what I'm saying? I've listened to a lot of diss records in my life. I. Like, if that was a verse directed at two at two of hip hop's current giants, then that was, I mean, I could, I call that lukewarm at best. You know what I'm saying? Like that's not, you know. And and I saw somebody say, I saw the homie say that he was baiting them, right? And in my mind, I'm like, that's not bait. You know why that's not bait? Because they baited him. <laughs> what you think first person shooter was? It was bait. And he ate it. And he ate it, right? And now people try to act like it's Kendrick baiting them. Mm-hmm. Come on, bro. Nah, it's time for you to respond. You took the bait, now swing. Right? If you're going to take the bait, swing. Even in your song, you're talking about the bait <laughs> that, they, that they got you on. Like you're proving you were caught in the trap that they set for you. You better swing. Ain't no, ain't no bait inside the trap they caught you in. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And again, I, 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 I truly feel like, and then, you know, I was making the joke earlier. The biggest line is, this ain't no big three, it's just big me. The person y'all are saying is the greatest rapper of all time rhymed three in me. And that's supposed to be the most wild bar of the whole shit? Are you fucking kidding me? Nah, bro. With respect to Kendrick and everything that he can do, and I, and I say this too because y'all are, y'all said before, like y'all said, um, I think Kendrick definitely has the potential and the ability to respond. And blah 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 blah. Nigga, LeBron James had the potential to have 38 rings by now. Are we talking about potential? Or are we talking about what actually happens and is currently happening? You know what I'm saying? Like, and that's it. Like. Can Kendrick do this? Absolutely. Can have we seen Kendrick do amazing things? Yes. When's the last time 
I'm going to tell you why. I'm going to tell you the edge J. Cole and Drake have in, in, a, in, a, in a scenario like this. You want to know what what is the – I feel like both of them have this. I just feel like J. Cole does it better uh, or does it more skillfully. Um, is that they're more relatable. Mm. Right? Like, you know, I'm, I'm sorry, bro. Like, hey, at the me. end of the day – at the end of the day, man, you can talk, you can diss these dudes in binary code. You know what I'm saying? And, and it'd be the smartest thing ever. You know what I'm saying? But if somebody else understands and feels and knows what somebody else is talking about when they diss you, you lost. That's it. If somebody got to go and look up or read the lyrics in reverse to understand what you did, you lost. <clears throat> I definitely agree with that. Yeah. yeah. You know what I'm saying? It's always the... What, what was that giant in the um that rap documentary Kanye was saying he was rapping his ass off in the battle and and the other dude said my name is Chris and you smell like piss <laughs> and, and you know what I'm saying like it really you know what I'm saying it's really about the punchline giant which is I feel like Drake is, is, yeah. is but I feel a, like that's what force. I feel like that's why the Kendrick is just big me was so yeah. it ain't it ain't it wasn't a crazy line but the energy in that motherfucker, yeah, the audacity yeah. of that facts. is really Big crazy, facts. bro. Like, but is that audacity or is that delusion? That's I, my I point. I think it's audacity. I, I think really, it's I think this nigga on God. Like, like if not, I think he tours, thinks he's on God level. I think he's not. This, this nigga tours has been crazy. Like he, it's, it's millions of niggas. Like it's a whole, it's whole countries of niggas. No, like, facts though. Big like facts bowing though. to this nigga. Like Big it was whole. Facts. Hey, dog. It was whole. There was probably more people when Nelly came out. You gonna try to tell me Nelly was on God level? Nelly went diamond. She Nelly. We Nelly talking Nelly about Nelly rap. Was. We talking Nelly about said rap. He what? Nigga, yeah. Nelly said this was the hardest yeah. era of rap. Yeah. But, but I'm saying though, no. are you trying to tell me on some battle stuff? He's that he would have been on God level because he because his tours was crazy. Nah, but yeah. Nelly went Kendrick because, either. Yeah. <laughs> but that's my point. I'm just saying when well, you, say you're, you're bringing up, you're bringing up, man. He's on tour. He got a whole bunch of people coming out. He's selling out stadiums. We talking about a battle. Also, also. If we talking about some LeBron, it's two niggas. It, you, it, if, it, if this dude go down as Kendrick's fall, it took two of the, the coldest niggas, the most juggernaut niggas, to not come out. It's just him. Nah, it's just me. Like come on, like that's crazy. Hold on, but but hold on. So so what would you say was the knockout then? The, this the either first person, the first person shoot. That's or not a knockout. No, or, no, no. Or whatever, whatever. One of these, two of these niggas come I, back with. I think you're conflating. I think you're you're okay. So first person shooter was the bait. Kendrick responded. Right? What we're talking about is is things that hasn't happened. And meaning like it's it's what who responds. Kendrick and I mean I'm sorry, Drake and Cole are not gonna be like, all right, let's make another song together. So to, to it's gonna be one. No, it's gonna be other. Cole. Cole's gonna show up on a loop and, and slaughter. Mm. Drake is gonna drop a disc to get his album sold for the next fifteen years. Yeah, He's gonna yeah. say little cool things, say it on the stage. And make sure that money keep going in. Drake, Drake's goal is the money. It's not It's not this rap respect thing. Like, you know what I'm saying? Cole is like, no. I am I am the greatest rapper. Yeah, and so, you know, so that's what you're saying. You're saying if Cole come back and it's over for Kendrick. I don't know if I said I don't, that. I don't, I don't know if it's over. I'm, yeah. I, I, don't, I, have, I, I don't know. If Control Kendrick shows up, then we got something. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But, but what I'm saying is this. It, it's like saying, hey, yo. Kobe, let's say 2005 Jordan versus 2005 Kobe, right? When Jordan was at his peak, Jordan all day, mm -hmm. right? But you asking 1996 Jordan to go against 2005 Kobe. Yeah. Right now, this is Cole's land. Cole owns rap right now. Bar for bar, lyric for lyric is Cole, right? You asking, you asking uh, Kendrick to go back and do something he did before the world got a virus. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> I, uh, in other words, so if 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 he can tap back into that, then fine. But in the last five years, I ain't yeah, seen nothing to suggest that, yeah. that he is still that person. <clears throat> I see what you're saying. That's why I say, like, the more and more I think about like all of these factors, like before I really just deep dive into this song, it's just like, damn. I'm like, Kendra did not come with it at all. Like I and I and I was rooting for it. Like I came in the room, like hell yeah, kid, you killed that shit. Period. But <laughs> like, <laughs> I, feel, I feel like he killed that shit. I feel like. And I what, feel, what was the I, best line? What's the best lines? I still feel like he had. Uh, I still feel like he had great delivery. I love the um, great delivery. All right, what you got, C Major? <laughs> 
I do like the line. Um, big three is big. It's not big three. Is uh, big yeah. me. I do like the line before all my dogs die. Yeah, and I don't even know what okay. what was the line in first person. I I honestly I I fuck with first person shooter. It it's like, a it's a dope first song. Person shooter, something like I'm that. talking about the actual first person shooter song. Like what was the line in there? Like who like who who really didn't threw some crazy shots? Nobody really. No. That's my point. <laughs> so that's, that's what I'm saying. Point. So why so why is it why we why why we shitting on Kendrick? Like I feel like. They both did the same thing. Like, like I feel like it's one one, or, or whatever the fuck. And it's two against one. <laughs> like, what the fuck is we talking? Like, it's just me. <laughs> I think I think the perspective you're looking at this is different from the way I'm. Meaning, like, I think you're. I think chronologically, the perspective you're looking at it is, like, to me, these are the lead ups to a battle, yeah. right? Like right now, Kendrick has not put out a song, and J Cole has not put out a song, and Drake has not put out a song directly pointing at opposition. Like, nobody right. has dropped 1,000% diss records. Right. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, there have been things said, there have been things inferred, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. What I am saying is that, Kendrick, if that's how you felt, right, about whatever they said or whatever, if you're King Kendrick, right, and you had a problem with what they said, right, that, that verse, e even on, some memor on, on it being memorable, Right, people are gonna remember first person shooter way more than they're gonna remember it's that verse or song. That shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, Go on, going back to what uh, Kia said earlier, I was I actually looked up the lyrics um, or whatnot when he was like, um, he was like, love when they argued, uh, love when they argued the hardest MC is it K Dot, is it Aubrey or me? We the big three, like we started a league, but right now I feel like Muhammad Ali. Like he wasn't dre he wasn't dissing at all. He ain't even say nothing bad about. He ain't even say nothing about. It's just me and Drake or nothing like that. To me, it was the the Spider Man meme line that I felt like was a shot at Kendrick. Spider Man. Uh, oh, the uh, Spider Man meme <clears throat> is uh, me looking at Drake. It was. It's like we recruited your homies to be demon deacons. We gotten. We got them attending your wake. The fuck? How they talk this shit? But yeah. <laughs> I feel like I'm slow nah, reading I, I, this Yeah, shit. I, I mean, to that point, what you were just saying, Neem, like, I feel like this was like, okay, we have, we have stated that we are now in opposition, and now it's time to drop the junts. Uh, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <Absolutely>. <laughs> That's the most key in my show. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Wait, <that's>, Absolutely. <laughs> we have stated. <laughs> Everyone. <laughs> <laughs> we have stated that we are in opposition. That's that's like you slapped them with the yeah. <laughs> yeah, bro. That's what they used. They used to send the declaration of war. Like, okay, yeah. you know what I'm saying. So, you know, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not going to be upset that Kendrick didn't respond with a diss record. You know what I'm saying? Uh, so, you know, we'll, yeah, we'll see. Show your full Just hand like control, he didn't respond with a diss record. He, he responded with a diss verse. Hmm? It's, it's all been diss verse, not diss records. Diss verses. Right. It, well, I don't really, I don't really consider nothing. This, I, I just feel like this is just the declaration of war. This ain't even been no this verse, this record, you know. I think Kendrick kind of started something. Kendrick, he Kendrick's don't know. Was a this verse though? Yeah, mm. it was. That's why I was like, Kendrick kind of started something that he didn't know that he was starting. And now, I don't think he started. Right. Yeah. I don't think he started. Yeah. Think so. <laughs> so yeah, but you know, I. Honestly, I'm excited. Like, cause, I am too. Like, you know, I cause Kendrick, cause like, that's one thing that is different. You know, I have to agree that like, if this was in 2000, you know, 14 and, and trust me, I, I've been a J Cole fan, you know, not even since Friday night, night Light, since after all that shit, you know what I'm saying? And I've been like, uh, Forest Hill Drive, Born Center, like them giants. I was, those are part of my, like, you know, adolescence. No. Same way Kendrick was. So mm -hmm. I'm super a J. Cole fan. But, you know, if this had happened in 2014, there's no way I would have said that J. Cole could nah. could could withstand a, 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 a straight up battle nah. <laughs> with Kendrick. Mm -hmm. Now it's, it, it definitely mm -hmm. feels like oh, this will be a fun competition. But I definitely don't think that J. Cole is standing that far above uh, Kendrick Lamar to where Kendrick is just lost in, in terms of. When like, you what, say that, do you do you mean. As far as lyricism, mm -hmm. or just hold on, R real quick. I'm sorry. I just want to shout out people in the in the, in the chat. Daz, what up, homie? Rod T, what up? Okay. What up? G Ghost, what up? Sonny, what up? Oh, Gus, good. what up? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? We got some uh, LJs in the building as well. Awesome, Michael. 
We got some interesting opinions on here. There's <laughs> an insect town. Sack town. Sack town LJ. Teabag in the town. Nice plan. Yeah, uh, yeah, I had fun Jay. with that, man. Uh, Hell sack, Jay. So, so dad <laughs> says the Kendrick verse was a warning shot. Let the games begin. That's exactly. Uh, but I, I, I feel like it was the return of a warning shot. You know what I'm saying? Like, and that's that's the part where I'm yeah, like, that's where he's fucking. Yeah. yeah, it's yeah. like, and and I feel like. He's trying to put anyway. I'm, I'm gonna go. I, I, like I agree with the warning shot. I don't. Type I don't like the return of a warning shot. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Just shoot back. You know, because um, he didn't start. Like anyway, uh, let me see what, what my man Go saying. Go saying. Um, I think regarding Drake and Cole, they are more relatable because they are in the loop. They don't only drop music twice a decade. Kendrick be disappearing and come back with the funk of last year he dropped. That's it. He Drake lying, and Cole though. are in the middle, are in the mode Damn. already. Kendrick playing catch up. That's facts. Damn. Yeah, that's facts. That's facts. He ain't lying. That's facts. That's true. Gus said that is the coolest bucket hat I've ever seen. Period. Thank you. I made it myself. Mm -hmm. It's it's reversible. Ghost goes again said, like I said, Kendrick's still living in 2013. That's facts. That's facts, bro. I th I'm telling you, I don't think he realized, bro. Your little brother. No, he did not grow up as fast as you did, but he kept growing. Damn. Damn, K Dot. <laughs> <laughs> nah, you better put some. Bro, they wasn't talking about you, fam. Mm -hmm. I promise yeah, they right. wasn't. They bro, included you. Bro, did y'all know that J Cole produced High Power? Yeah. What? I did not know I that till today. Yo, you know what? Hold on. Look, 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 I'm, I'm going to talk about this a little bit. Rati says that this wasn't dissy enough for me. I feel that. DC. I, I want to talk about that though. I like that word. There was something I was thinking about last night. I was like, "Yo, that's kind of interesting." It feels like J Cole's ascension into like the upper echelons of rap happened when he stopped producing as much. Yeah, yeah, he started locking mm -hmm. in. Mm -hmm. And he just said, "No, I'm just a rapper." Mm -hmm. Pen game got crazy. Yeah. You know. And that was that was when like he was thinking about retirement. And again, I feel like. This is why this is exciting because from the beginning, like J. Cole only cared about the respect. Like, I feel like yeah. he is 100 yeah. percent like for these conversations yeah. like this. I, it, like, that's yeah. I, feel like, I feel like that's why the Yachty, the him and Yachty jump was so polarizing because oh, yeah. they were the size of the scale. Like yeah. Cole was the boring rap. I care about pure rap, nigga. And, mm -hmm. and Yachty was and Yachty in, they talked it. about it in the, in the, in the podcast. Mm -hmm. Like mm -hmm. Yachty, was, Yachty got a diss song about Cole. Mm -hmm. Like Yachty, Yachty's first song was a J. Cole diss song. <laughs> like he diss, he diss Cole because all that rapping, all that. Because they was yeah. like the, the both different sides of this shit. I, I, so, so. With that, that's why J. Cole, this is going to be dope because he's going to show up for that conversation specifically. And I also feel like that's the school that Kendrick comes from. He's like, yeah. victory is we end this conversation yeah. and say one of them two is better. Like, that's 100% what they care about. So that's why this is going to be fun. And I feel like it's going to be, you know, unless he do, <laughs> it was, unless I, one of them do what uh, Drake did to Meek Mill or what Pusha T did you know, to I'm Drake. Saying, yeah, that, <laughs> I feel like though no, it's, it's gonna be a long battle. Cole got no. caught in a crossfire between uh, Drake and Kendrick because Drake and Kendrick been going at it for years. Yeah, and, I just and think everybody, Cole was just and everybody a, puts them two above him for yeah, his whole career. Yeah, but, and but I those just, two were above. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. finish what you're saying. Yeah, no, but I was just thinking that I just feel like he's just got caught, caught in the crossfire of all of this or whatnot. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. now you know what I'm saying he's like big fish up there with Drake now or whatnot, and you know. Kendrick, yeah. Go ahead, say what you were going to say. I don't think he got caught in the crossfire. I think Cole is probably the most. Cole is incredibly intelligent. I think he knew exactly where he, what he was putting himself. Put himself I think exactly he, he was aware of what he was involved in and how it might turn out. I also think, yeah, you know, I don't think he just felt. I think it was true. Drake and Kendrick, like, left him out of the conversation. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like. For mm -hmm. all of his career, I'm telling you, and this is why I challenged what you were saying earlier, where it was like you were saying you never heard nobody say that. I'm like, I don't know what you're talking about. All of 2023 was like, man, I think Cole got Kendrick. I kept hearing that everywhere. All my rapper homies, all my lyricists, home, you know, all my Facebook pages, it was just like, nah, I don't know. I just kept, I kept seeing that over and over and over again. And, um, and that's what I'm saying. Like, I, I, that's why I, I don't think Kendrick is like, yo, I'm on God level, blah, blah, blah. I think... Oh no, I I do think Kendrick feels like he's on God. I just don't think he knows he's not. Yeah. 
I don't. I think he's he looking at he looking at that Pulitzer Prize. Yeah. He looking at you know the, the pictures of him wearing the crown of thorns mm-hmm. like Jesus. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And yeah. this man really think if you that's a real God complex. Yeah. I don't think he realizes you are a mortal man. Interesting yeah. how that plays. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And right now somebody has grown bigger and stronger than you. Right in this game, more relevant than you, more listened to than you. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And um, yeah. And I think I think if you're gonna throw a shot back, man, you better respect that. I'm, you know, I I didn't been in that situation. You know what I'm saying? With respect. You know what I'm saying? I've been a lot of people's little homies, <laughs> and come back around and been a giant. You know what I'm saying? Big. So, I get it. Damn, bro. Yeah. What if Ken, bro, Kendrick got to still be that nigga though? If Kendrick, mm. <laughs> if Kendrick yeah. gets slaughtered, and it's and it's like a quick slaughter. If it's a long drawn <laughs> I, I, out, I think, I think it's gonna be a long drawn out battle. If it's a bro. quick slaughter, bro, it's, 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 <laughs> this is gonna be a long drawn out crazy. battle. But I think the difference between this one is is like because Drake and uh, Kendrick's um, battle has been long and drawn out. But the difference is all of their battle have been subliminals. Yeah. This yeah. will not. I, be. I don't respect. Yeah. That. I don't yeah. respect this. Yeah. Like, yeah. Is that? I don't yeah. respect, respect the Drake Kendrick thing. It's not. I wonder if Kendrick. But still, he was. They was not talking about him. That's what I'm. Like for Who me, actually talking? looking at the lyrics, Kendrick and Drake was not talking. About oh no, we talk. But this go back years. But yeah. we forget first person shooter. Like, yeah, we. we well, I know. About. Yeah, Kendrick and Drake been going at it or whatnot. But like when it come to Cole verse, Cole mm. did not shoot no shot at Kendrick, and for I, Kendrick I to agree. come back yeah. like he did. I, I definitely think he did. But, but that's so I, I think he did, but he if didn't. It, in a sign of respect, Kendrick didn't. He just he just said he was the one. Like, but that's yeah. just some competitive. That's and he didn't say no shit. names either. That's some hooping yeah. shit. Like, what the fuck he supposed to say? Yeah, <laughs> what yeah. he supposed yeah. to say? Yeah. Nah, y'all niggas do get it. I ain't gonna lie, y'all. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. For me, that goes back to that delusion where it's just like, <clears throat> like if people ain't calling you God, that means they dissed you. Okay, now you. you sound know like what I'm saying? Some, like, sound like some yay shit. That's like. That's delusional, Damn. bro. You are very fallible. Damn, dude. Yeah, he, he be, he be, he, he be, I mean, he been like, yeah, you know what I'm saying? On. Smoking on top five. Like, Come on. You know, <laughs> like, smoking on top five. <laughs> tonight. <laughs> that's, that's tonight. Yeah. Tonight. Bro, bro niggas be forgetting yeah, about the yeah, way, I bro. Forgot about Them baby shit, King features Them baby crazy, King shows was crazy. Yeah, 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 I, they yeah. just, man, that shit hype me up. My nigga Kendrick still get it. My nigga Kendrick still get it. I forgot about the baby King shit. I forgot about that shit. Nah, this shit is going to be good. I was thinking like, that. Yeah, right. Y'all really think Kobe and a murder kid? Yeah. I don't know. Yeah, so. Now I don't know again. That's good. That's a, that's a good place to be. That's, that's a good place to be. I don't well, know. Cole, well, Cole is that nigga. on your top five tonight. That's Cole just, speaks yeah. to... I ain't even gonna lie. Cole speaks to... I ain't saying Kendrick don't, but Cole speaks to, like, the people. Like, lyrically. No, Kendrick, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, Kendrick... People. Yeah, you, Kendrick... You go yeah, like, yeah. Kendrick speaks... <laughs> To the uh, philosophical streets, I'll say that. Like niggas who want to go deep, di- deep sea diving, but still talk about the shit that's going on in the in uh, in the streets and whatnot. Cole speaks to the streets and to the people. You know what I'm saying? Like, like the streets and the people. Yeah, <laughs> it's two. It's two different levels. Period. Damn. <laughs> you know. All right, okay, so we got a big shout out to my man Daz. Bro. He says that he' about to head out before he goes. Shout out to y'all. Y'all got outer space looking like this. Period. Looking out of this world, pun intended. Yes, sir. P.S. Yeah. Tell C Major, I said I wasn't gonna do it. Was, yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> yes, sir. No doubt. Big shout out, my man. Big shout out, Tizo. Um, Rati says, and this is a, this is a great question. Has Kendrick peaked while Cole is still ascending? My answer is unequivocally mm. yes. Mm. Absolutely. Mm. Absolutely. Mm. Name one. Name anything that would suggest he has an upward trajectory at this point. I can name you ten things to suggest J. Cole still has an upward trajectory. Yeah. Damn. Those uh, those Damn, baby king okay, features God. definitely yeah, re excited me. Yeah, but about even Kendrick's. Up was a couple years. Yeah. So there, there was a couple years ago. So I'm I'm hoping that this was uh I'm hoping this is the 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 flame that just turns up a feature Kendrick. You know what I'm saying? Like, because it's been a long time since that was even a thing. Feature Kendrick. Like that was. Damn, I, this nigga did it on the future song. <laughs> <laughs> on future like, that's why i damn I'm, metro <laughs> i'm wow, trying metro to figure out nigga music. how you get in that room like what the fuck that's what i was wondering i was just like did they all just get together and be like hey man we don't like drake you <laughs> yeah, don't like drake yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, I, 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 how did the diss track 
end up on the Metro Future album. I feel like Metro had a lot to do with it. I feel like Metro had a lot. Like I'm, I'm, I just, Metro I just want to see that conversation on some like, yeah, on some like. Yeah. You know what? Let me call it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, gotta, yeah, I, I got a song bro. over a Memphis beat. Let's, yeah. let's, let's shout out DJ oh. Paul and Juicy J, bro. Yeah. And, right? <laughs> hey, yo, K Dot, man. You fuck with, with Juicy J and, yeah. uh, and DJ Paul? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, me too, bro. Look, lately I ain't really got no love for Drake. I, 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 don't, <laughs> I know that the history yeah. between y'all. Let, let's do, I got an album coming out, man. Let's do it. Let's oh, do it. my right. God. When future, future about to be on there, too. When, <laughs> what, when did right. First Person Shooter come out? Uh, last year. Um, yeah, I came out last year. Okay. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I was thinking, like, months. all right, cool. First person shooter, I know um, when I was coming back from A3C in September, that's when the Coliati coming for their respect. Yeah. yeah. That came out. Yeah. First person shooter came out maybe like a month and a half, maybe two months mm-hmm, later. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. So at the end of 23. <clears throat> okay. Yeah. So that sounds about. When did Mr. Morales come out then? Because that, that was, was like not February too. February or something like that. I was trying to say that was in the same year. 22, I think, yeah, actually. Yeah. What? Yeah, it's been a yeah, it really? Was, it was 22, because we was at uh, 777. <laughs> yeah. Damn. Mm-hmm. Yep. Yeah, February or March. We gonna see, man. We gonna <laughs> see. <laughs> this man. Now, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. You, we talking about baiting. Hey, we talking about baiting. Hey, shout out my man Ghost, man. This uh this post uh, let uh, Tim Love Jr. tell it Kendrick been dropping the illest verses since COVID. Now that's a bait. He baited my man uh, Luca to come in here. Let me see what's up. Right. This man came in. I don't know what's going on, bro. But y'all need to calm down. Damn, bro. <laughs> 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 Fam, yo, and bro, I just want to say this because Drake is Drake is. Definitely definitely a factor still in this to me and just i just thought it was interesting how like drake is so interesting because bro drake bro he definitely was throwing shots at kendrick on multiple verses right of course. over the years but then would literally like shout him out like on stage after all you know what I'm saying? But then we have interview very, very Kanye. Kind of but then is. you know what I'm saying very <laughs> then, <laughs> have, then <laughs> have interviews <laughs> then have interviews talking <laughs> shit against him. Oh, oh, oh Jackson, this 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 is that compression level that don't be getting set, you feel me? <laughs> this is what I be talking about. <laughs> then we'll have then we'll diss him, you know what I'm saying, in an interview. Then come out, you know what I'm saying, and then shoot a picture of some old DMs like what you know what I'm saying, what happened, we bro? Know what kind then, of nigga Drake then they'll send is. a congratu- Exactly. Drake is that Drake petty type. Is bro, Drake, what is Drake? I'm saying Drake is what is he? Drake very is King petty. petty. Bro, he is uh, he is petty and very like wishy washy. And that. so I bring that up to very say much so. I bring that up to say this, right? So he'll diss him and then shout him out. Yeah. Right? So I, I bring that up just to point out something I saw was funny today. He said the dudes in the uh, YouTube comments was like, imagine uh, Drake's uh, ghostwriter was beefing with Kendrick while he was trying to while Drake was trying to make amends on social I'm media, done. and that's what's been happening all this time. Mm. Wow, you know that's just saying? like Drake. Put, rap, uh, rap conspiracy Drake put, uh, what's his name? Jack Harlow on and and left uh, left his ass out to dry for a good, for a good little minute. Jack Harlow had to go through commercials and shit just to get back on. Now he's got that song, um, the. G L glamorous giant, like he uh, stop fucking with Ice Spice, <laughs> put her out there on French Street. Stop fucking with her. The only person that I saw he really tried to do some shit with was uh, Sexy Red. Now he don't even be in be in her stuff no more. Like, mm. like Drake, big petty, Drake, king petty. Like he'll be in and be yeah. out. I'm, Drake, I'm, Drake is like a new Kanye, bro. Yeah, like, yeah. you know when it comes to that type. Dark stuff. side of Kanye. Yeah, he, yeah. Well, he, I don't, I don't say, I don't know if he dark. in and out. Like he, he give you a cosign, and then it's up to you to do <laughs> to, to to move. I feel from you that. on that. Like, mm. no, it, but he definitely moved similar to Kanye in regards to like problems with absolutely. People. Yeah, nah, yeah. Sure. absolutely. Yeah. Sure. Mm-hmm. Yeah, them folks did a whole cut, con- bro. That that job was legendary, and Kanye with his ass. Kanye kicked Drake's yeah. ass, bro. But but it wasn't even fair because Drake didn't know. <laughs> I feel like Drake did not know he was coming into a battle, fool. It was a, a benefit concert nah, for Larry Hoover. Nah, fool. them nah, them niggas had rehearsal, bro. <laughs> you think Drake was in bro, Kanye Drake, rehearsal, bro? Drake in the middle of his no, tour. No, no, no. Drake was singing the Kanye song. He was singing the twenty four, which and then means Kanye which, did, which means they plan, your loving. which means they planned that shit out. Bro. Yeah, that's Drake, the only thing he probably knew. 
Drake, <laughs> he know Kanye came, was gonna go through the Drake whole catalog. Drake came way harder, bro. And Drake's catalog could have competed, bro. For real, fam, that's, what, that's how you know he fam, didn't know. I did. I did a party, bro. This is this one thing, Drake, fam. This is why. <laughs> At the end, this, this why, this why. At the end of the day, at the end of the day, at the end of the day, bro, like they got in. We going we gonna have this conversation. J Cole, Kendrick, bars, right? And it, bro, I hate to admit it, but at the end of the day, mm. we all gonna go home and listen to Drake. To, to, and listen to Drake. You right? You right? <laughs> but see, hold on. But see, like, hold on, hold on. Crazy. Okay, I feel you. You're right. I agree. You know what I'm saying? But I also feel like, I okay, when Jay went at Nas, that was the biggest yeah. battle I had ever seen. Yeah. Uh, you know, the most publicized battle I had seen in my life when that happened. Like, uh, and I was in New, no, I was, I was, I was in Florida. I was still at UCF when that happened. Um, but I remember like, you know, a couple years later I was in New York and I just remember the outcome of, of everything. And now, I don't know about what was happening in the rest of the country. I know what was happening on the internet. But in New York, it was, like, it was outstanding. Nas murdered Jay-Z. Mm -hmm. Like, even if you go to all the radio talk shows, Power 105, Hot 97, all the talkers were like, wow. Nas just sliced up Jay-Z into 38 pieces. You know what I'm saying? All right. A few years later, when, you know, Jay-Z would continue his ascent into success, right? It, it, was, it was astonishing to me how quickly history could be rewritten mm -hmm. just because Jay-Z was a more successful artist, Yeah. right? And so I remember ever since then telling myself, like, no, like, I'm not going to fall victim to, like, you know, like, is this a battle or not? Right? Are we going bar for bar, verse for verse, song for song? Or are we battling finance and successful careers? Because and it, it's, it's got to be one or the other. And I can't let one affect the other. You know what I'm saying? Meaning, like, for me, it's okay to compartmentalize that and say, nah, like, you know, we talking about who's the most successful rappers of all time, right? You can't not mention um, Beastie Boys. You can't not mention Nelly. You have to mention Eminem. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. these are people who went diamond, 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 triple platinum. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Right. Who was the best rappers of all time? You can't not mention somebody that's not, the, I mean, maybe Eminem can, if, you know, I, it's arguable, you know what I'm saying? But you're going to mention a whole different group of people. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And And so that's why it's like, I, I try not to mention somebody's artist's success when we talking about battles. So, like, mm -hmm. the idea of Drake continuing and he's successful and people are going to go and listen to the songs, blah, blah, blah. Like, I, I, if I even have that thought in a scenario like this, I take it, I remove it, I throw it away. Because to me, it doesn't count in this conversation. I understand. Yeah. It's, just, it's, just a, it's just a crazy phenomenon, like, from a third-person point of view. Like, yeah. Particularly because he's kind of in this big three conversation that like <laughs> we just gonna listen to one of the three. At oh. the end of the day. Damn, I'm, I'm laughing. At, yo, hey Luca, pull up, bro. You know what I'm saying? Pull up, bro. This man said, "Where are you going with this knees?" Damn, bro. Let me get my thought out there. <laughs> <laughs> man said, man said, be careful, bro. <laughs> man said, Come on, bro. <laughs> but yeah, bro. Uh, and I feel like all right, so. Yeah, one of my this now this wasn't a crazy bar because I don't remember what it rhymed with, but it's definitely it definitely Damn. was the, the the line of the Kendrick joint that made me think about it the most. Is he mentioned? I feel like this was a shot at Drake. Now this is this could be a reach, but I don't even know what the like the bar was. But he was like, uh, "Prince outlived Michael Jackson." Mm. I feel yeah, like I remember that did. line. I feel but like what that. did it have anything to do with? Hey, hold on, hold on, real quick, Luca. You said not true, Maestro. What, what were you referring to? Which, yeah, 
Lucas said you you've been you've been capping this whole time, bro. Yeah, bro. Man. I feel like no matter what it is, I'm going to agree with Lucas. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, <laughs> right was, it, was it that everybody's going to go home and listen to Drake after this conversation? Yeah, that might be. That might you know what? I think that's it. I think that's the one. That sounds yep, that's like something you would not agree with. Man. It, uh, yeah, fam. Because like, Lucas is definitely not listening to Drake. <laughs> <laughs> okay, maybe except hey, everybody except Lucas. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? But if you pull up to a function, bro, <laughs> best believe they pulling up, uh, you know what I'm saying? They may play first-person shooter, and that's that's how you're going to hear that J. Cole. Or they may play 21 Savage, and that's how you hear J. Cole. But just the Cole song, they're just the Kendrick song, mm. maybe from 2012, fucking right. problem or something. You know Damn what I'm right. saying? Hey, Austin, what's the reason? Swimming pools. <laughs> Swimming pools? Yeah. Nigga Prince outlive Mike Jack. Nigga Bone. Nigga Bone. Yeah, I feel like Damn, Prince Love Live Mike Jack was just like the was the Kendrick saying, "Man, fuck your success, bro." The you know what I'm saying? Because Michael Jackson, you know what I'm saying, the biggest artist. What did he to mean by live. "got two T's with me"? I'm snatching chains and burning tattoos. Is up, bro. It's Kendrick. You gotta go like dissect this. <laughs> That's what Kendrick. That's what Kendrick be doing, bro. You gotta go. Man. I don't know what he meant by that. You don't Marcus know. Marcus Logan, can't, you, if a nigga gotta go to an encyclopedia to understand what you said, you can't win a battle like that, bro. At first, like, I thought you know he was, at first I thought it had something to do with him. We don't know. Real, but I don't really what's, know what he was talking. What's the meaning of this bar? We don't what? know. Man, naming pyramid schemes and. You know what I'm saying? Come on, bro. That's, you know what I'm saying? That's a judge. <laughs> yeah, that's and, and, and bro, that's a lot of stuff. Like I didn't know E40 used that same sample, and it was him yeah, and whoever water. So, so I just be having to be like, it's just some stuff I don't know. Like, hold on, hold on, hold on. You know? Lucas said it's because them niggas soft. That's what that meant. Okay, I I agree. I think those guys are soft. You know what I'm saying? Kendrick ain't soft. Really? You try to tell me Kendrick is tougher yeah. than Drake lie, or, or Cole? Morales was crying. Kendrick like five five, bro. Yeah, no, no, no. Fire. We're talking about toughness. We're talking about albums. Yeah, ain't none of these yeah, dudes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. None of these dudes is gangsters. Not one of them. None of these dudes. Kendrick right? just talk about gangsters more. He ain't no gangster. Yeah, I'm too short. And Kendrick, that's, that was his brand. Good kid in the mass Absolutely. city. Absolutely. Right? He a good kid. He a good kid. Literally. He a good kid. This man said Compton. Whatever, dog. It's soft people from Memphis. Period. I can say Memphis. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Period. <laughs> Ain't nobody trying to say yeah. that. said, nah, man. That's it, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 well, I don't know. See... Yeah, well, I mean, really, really, it's who got the best security. Honestly, it's, it's, it's who that's got the a best squad security. With it. Yeah. 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 But yeah. at the same time, like, all right, yeah. now this is controversial. That's I'm not really, I want to see, nigga. So this is gonna be controversial. Drake I'm not. I'm not trying to. Everybody. I'm not trying to. You know, start nothing. You know what I'm saying? But like, both of them niggas supposedly fought Diddy. You know what I'm saying? Drake yeah, and, and, and Cole. Supposedly whoop Diddy. Nah, uh, Cole, Cole whooped supposedly Diddy. Whooped Diddy. Cole supposedly whooped Diddy ass. And yeah, Drake Cole. supposedly got slapped up. Supposedly. <laughs> you know <what> <laughs> supposedly. Like, bro, I wasn't so there. So Cole I, ready for the squad. <laughs> like, if he re- Cole Jake, is like Jake, six, what? Cole six three? Yeah, Cole, Cole, Cole is big fuck. as hell. And Diddy is He's not a, small. Ain't them dreads make him even taller. <laughs> like, <laughs> no Diddy. No Diddy. I got you. <laughs> Diddy not smart, no Diddy. <laughs> no Diddy, bro. So you know what I'm saying? J Cole might, you know, Cole ready for the squad. Bro. Yeah, you say he done grew out them dreads. Man. You know what I'm saying? I Norman, no man. Yeah, I don't know. He might be. Man. He be wearing, you know, just the, he be. He's just ready. You know I what can't saying? see Kendrick. Yeah, be like, you know what I'm saying? I can't see Kendrick whipping color last. I, I, I can't see that either. <laughs> I can't see that either. Hell no. That's like him standing next to Shaq. <laughs> Hell no. Mm-mm. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. And J. Cole don't wear a chain, so it couldn't have been directed at uh, J. Cole. It had to be directed Kendrick don't directly at, at Drake. Well, he said he was snatching chains, right? In that line? Oh, yeah. So it had to have been directed what, at Drake. What's the name? Don't wear chains like that neither. He wears some kind of um, Nick Choker. Drake. <laughs> 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 Drake, Drake are really suffering in this conversation yeah. right now, <laughs> So clearly that, wasn't, that line wasn't about them. Code man. the most swab of the nigga <laughs> out of these three. We just comparing that for so. My nigga Drake wearing chokers. <laughs> My nigga Drake wearing chokers. Kendrick 5'6". Oh, shit. Yo. But you know what? Yeah. Another, another, point, another point on the control verse, bruh. Bro, that was like 
one of Big Sean's best verses on that song. Oh yes, like and you the, know what's of his career, Big of his career, and it just got outshined. Yeah, like that's mm. wild. That was he was rapping, rapping on that jump, no right? Facts. Hold on, hold on. My man, my man Luca is really, really out here rapping right now. Fam. <laughs> he said, um, Kendrick told niggas on Pimp, nah, homie, y'all too sensitive. It spill out to the street. I'll make a call to get the West, to get the coast involved, and history will be repeat. Drake and Cole not ready for what's to come, y'all. Trust me. Now nah, I feel that. But I, we, I, we, I not, we talk that. about a Kendrick versus Drake, not yeah. a West Coast versus. Like that's what I'm saying. If the the battle ain't gonna be Kendrick, it's gonna be who which, which nigga got the best security or or street niggas they can call. Right? <laughs> like, like they not finna squabble though. Like Drake yeah. was Drake will send out and get niggas killed and shit. You, you know how Kendrick about to win, bro? Kendrick gonna win because he gonna uh, go and uh, get Suge Knight out of jail. You Type know what I'm saying? Suge <laughs> Knight is these. Yeah. Because yeah. let's world. be clear, on some West Coast East Coast stuff. Nah, that was Suge Knight versus East Coast. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Suge Knight is a true <laughs> killer. Suge you know what I'm like, saying? Like that's that's what it was, bro. Like, <laughs> and bang and put that bitch in reverse. Man. He put that bitch in reverse and looked at the Suge Knight is rolling <laughs> over people on movie sets. <laughs> and it's a thousand cameras. <laughs> it's a movie set, bro. Like, <laughs> and nigga stuck his head out the window like nigga. You know what it is, bro. Yeah. It's me, bro. Come on, man. It's just me. Come on, bro. Come on, dog. Put some respect on the kitchen. I yeah, feel you. Ah, oh, damn. Oh, shit. Dang, well. Yeah. Can't you get the. I don't know. Drake got some hitters. Though. I feel like Drake got some secret service type niggas. That's what I'm saying. Drake got way more money than yeah. so. Mm. I don't know if Drake got more money than Kendrick though. Yes. I, yes. I that a, is that yes. definitely for sure? No, no, that's that's got to be for sure. Yes. Okay. I feel like it, it should It depends be. on how much. I don't know fam, it depends. Like, I don't know how much your price increase when you win, like, album of the year or whatever. But every time that Drake and uh, Kendrick put out an album together, Kendrick definitely won, like, the awards type stuff. So maybe his price is just higher per, know, per joint. That's why Drake got to put out more joints. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't know. I don't I, think I that Drake, like Drake got more money. More Drake got, I feel like yeah, the way, yeah, the Nike deal probably more. took him. Took Drake him got yeah. money all the way out in Canada. Like, you know, he live out there in Canada and stuff. He got the stakes going on right now. Do you yeah. not know how much it is to even bet on that damn I app? do not know. It's, it's a lot of money. Yeah. I think I think Drake got more money and the definitely can, you know Hell yeah. Right. And the way y'all talking, Kendrick, you know, don't got, he don't yeah, touch listen. nobody in Kendrick. I mean, in Compton no more. Listen. He don't speak for the streets at all. All right, so. let, me, let me hop into the comments. The comments is, 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 is coming through. Um, man, where do I even start? Um, Salvia says, I think Kendrick has also, by the way of drops or lack thereof, has made him more of a character that appears to be stoic. Also, the martial arts motifs probably have some weight to them if shit don't go into stick mode. So you saying yeah. Kung Fu Kenny about to come out of the roundhouse these days? Yeah, Damn, that's crazy. I didn't, I didn't hey. even think about that. I didn't think about that. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that nigga been training this whole yeah, time. Yeah, this whole time. Dr. Dre shit. Dr. Come back with the crime. He be hitting them push-ups too. He be hitting them like Dr. Dr. Dre disappeared like a mug. Dr. Dre came back like this. That's facts. That's facts. That's some West Coast type vibes. Yeah, so, you be know. Now, hold on, hold on. But again, let's be clear. Dr. Dre came back like this because of one man. Suge Knight. You know what I'm saying? He got the best connection. <laughs> that's, that's really what we're talking about. Really <laughs> what we're talking about. <laughs> <laughs> who, who, who has the first degrees of separation between? Shit? I don't know. Suge got that money though. Drake, nah, Drake, that's what I'm saying. Drake, 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 Drake I feel like Drake, a... Drake will let Suge out before Kendrick could. Yeah. On some money type vibes. Mm. Only on some money type vibes. Like, Man, I don't know, bro. I feel like if Trump get reelected, he might uh, he might get Suge out as well. <laughs> that would be crazy. <laughs> the streets are not safe. <laughs> Suge out. The streets is not safe, bro. At all. That be crazy. <laughs> <laughs> I'm walking out of my house immediately and looking. <laughs> looking around. Suge not get out on the presidential the party. <laughs> Oh my god. We trade, we trade uh, that nigga for somebody. I didn't even consider that being possible. <laughs> hey, <laughs> it's definitely possible, it's bro. Very possible it's thing. definitely possible. Hey, hold bro, on, hold on. Trump, you know, Trump we know Drake shit. moved like Kanye. Kanye got the connection to Trump. He, you know what I'm saying? He could probably do it. LJ said, I mean, Drake did say 21, can you do something for me? All right, that's yeah. what Damn. Hey, LJ, Drake got Jay Prince. That's a real one, too. Jay mm-hmm. Prince. I don't know if he's Suge level, but Jay Prince is one of Jay the Prince ones. Jay Prince is, is a. Mm-hmm. <laughs> he is funny. one of the ones. That's yeah. facts. But isn't he the one that made. Uh, didn't he squash one of Drake's beef? beef? It, was hey. to, it was supposed to be the Kanye Zen. Oh. That was why the whole Larry Hoover <laughs> concert uh, happened. Oh, man. Go says, Prince. Go says, I think all three got real street niggas behind them. Drake backed by Jay Prince. Facts, yeah. no doubt. Yeah. Um, my man Jackson Henderson says, I think Kendrick is playing a different game than Drake and Cole. Oh, absolutely. 
Definitely. Absolutely. Um, Luca is just Jake. laughing at I us. I was like, that's Jake's He's right here. Yeah. <laughs> 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 not Hendrix. I get you. I get you. Uh, yeah. What up, Jackson? Um, Ghost says, Kendrick going to win because he animated and loud. That's the smoke and mirrors from... Uh, for the common ear. Damn. Nah. Uh, nah. Hold on. Let, let me keep going before y'all, <laughs> before y'all respond. Um, Savia also says, also very telling that Kendrick got on the Memphis style beat and Drake often pulls from Memphis area influences. Yeah. While Cole was mentioned somewhat, he deaf is baiting Drake out to compete. I feel that. Um, somebody said Drake got Degrassi money. But I, I heard that money wasn't really all that money. You know what I'm saying? Hey, so that I, shit I was dumb. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he do got Nike but he money. Got, I was just going to yeah. say he got some money. Uh, Rati says, can we use per junt as an increment of measure? Absolutely. <laughs> per junt. Let's get it. PJ. You feel me? Uh, <laughs> 23 PJ. About a PJ. <laughs> I'm about to shit about a PJ. Nigga. Exactly. Per junt. <laughs> per junt, nigga. Uh, <laughs> Lucas, <laughs> says, Lucas says, Jay Prince won't get involved in this. Okay. And won't because he need to sit down anyway and chill yeah, out. Right, we well, Jay, Jay, Jay Prince just bought like chill out. Chill a out. whole village in That'd Africa. Cool. It's like literally two hundred acres. Shout out Jay Prince. Of, of like forest. Yeah. 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 Big shout out Jay Prince. Yeah. Yeah. Hey, Jay Prince, shout out my yeah. dude. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> no, for sure, for sure. No, Jay Prince, but he just need to chill out. Ah, oh, come on, Luca, man. <laughs> come on, man. You can't say that. You gotta read the comment, bro. Come this on, man say. says, "Am future is better than Drake." What? Mm. Bro, that man been hanging around Pro too much. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Moving on, on to the man. next subject. <laughs> that's that's, on, yeah, that's, a, right. that's a wild statement, bro. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Better in what? Having long hair? <laughs> Damn. <laughs> it's now, 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 now. Come on, man. It, it's it's all due respect to that, bro. Tim, they could go head to head. <laughs> But future and Drake, future and Drake go ahead to head. Well, not not as far not as far as lyrics, not as far as maybe, that, but as far maybe, as hits. Maybe in, far, in terms go, of hooks. Maybe in hits. terms of writing hooks. Maybe. Go, come on now, come on, y'all maybe. gotta give it to him. Nah. Like tit for tat. <laughs> March Madness. Can we go down the line? Bro, yeah, I can. We can. We can sit, spend. We can spend two days going through Drake hits. We will run out of future hits in about three hours. Mmm. Mm. I give him mm. that. I don't know about bro, that one, bro. So we hold on, we hold on. No, hold on, hold on. I give him that. Yeah. So are, are we talking about? Because every year, oh, again, got a hit. I, I feel like we gotta we gotta know exactly what we talking about. Yeah. We, are we talking about rap success? Are we talking about as a rapper, the craft of rap? We can't be talking about the craft either of one. Rap. <laughs> we can talk about either one, and Drake wins. That's what I'm trying to say. I, I, I think I do agree that Drake wins. I, mean, I, I feel you. Yeah. But. yeah. Yeah. But I just want to make sure we know we yeah. just because we, you know what I mean? The <laughs> yeah, Luca, if yeah. you say the craft of rap, please no. don't say that, bro. <laughs> no. Yeah, hold on. Let, let me see, let me let him chime in. LJ says, damn, Luca, I can't agree on that one. Like, <laughs> I feel uh, you. My man Jackson Hendricks' son, not Hendricks. <laughs> <laughs> we got a guy in the house named Jackson Hendricks. Period. A producer for the show, so that's why we keep shouting Shout that out. out. Um, my man uh, Jackson Henderson says, future got better street music. Okay, Facts. in in his lane. Nice. If we, like, I, we can do Facts. that. Let's do that. That's yeah, what I said. Both of them can go you tip got for ten. Yeah. Future make better street music than Drake. That's all right. That's I agree. The end of the conversation. I agree. All right. Future has had better albums since 2016, though. I will yeah. say that. Uh, Lucas says, "Stop, Major." Damn, he just he just telling you to stop, bro. That's crazy. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> <laughs> okay. LJ says, bad, nah, Drake will, ros will wash future on some rap shit. That's Big fact. period. Um, yeah. I mean, if we, if we talking about rap rap, nah, bro. Come on, man. Yeah. Um, <laughs> yeah future future repeat his lines probably about three, hey, two, three times. Lucas, Lucas, no, Lucas no, said, be, hold on, hold on. That would be a better argument. <laughs> this post, Lucas says, music in general. Future guy, <laughs> future no, guy. Nigga. Hold on a second. No, he got, he got pulled up for real. No, yeah, not you got pulled up. Because he's not fair. Damn, that is not. That's what's going not on, bro? Yeah, what's What's the biggest, Luca? What's the biggest future song yeah. what, besides the, March Madness? No, no, no. What's What's the best future song to you? Mm, we gonna wait for that one. I'm gonna read some more comments. Ghost says for the craft of rap, Drake by a landslide, which I agree. Um, Luca says. 
Uh, his, his jump was freezing up. Pause while y'all talking about what's going on. Future influenced a whole generation. That's true, but so did Drake. Okay. Yeah, Drake did. Yeah, that's Drake. Uh, Drake uh, <laughs> uh, started in Degrassi. Mm-hmm. <laughs> LJ says for a minute, folks couldn't even understand what Future was saying. That's facts. No, hold on. Let's, let's be clear about something. For, for a minute, people thought Future was T Pain. <laughs> Are we going to keep it all the way live? People was like, yo, that, that new T-Pain. They had no idea it was a <laughs> different rapper. <laughs> oh, yeah, absolutely. Especially in New York. Especially in New York. I was there when it happened. Nobody was name? like, what, that's another the dude? <laughs> designer. 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 I thought designer was future. A lot of Damn. people. When, when, the, when that... When T Pain was owning auto auto tune, and then other people started to Damn, show up, nigga. everybody was mad, confused. That's some New York shit. Yeah, yeah. 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 Future, future showing up. Uh, uh, like the auto tune was definitely dang, bro. Have y'all heard the early future and verses? And be in the wrong key. Have the you heard the early future bro. verses where he was on some rap shit? On the mixtapes. Nah. Yeah, period. Bro. Y'all gotta we gotta dig them up. Mm-hmm. That man was spitting too. Niggas stop featuring. Hey, Ghost go said, Luca, you just don't fuck with Drake, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he like <laughs> right there. Yeah. We falling for it. Like Kendrick fell for it. Right. <laughs> Yo, yeah. Luca going in right now. <laughs> A whole bunch of singers is what is what Drake influenced. Damn. 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 I mean, that's, that's that hold on, but was that Drake true. or was that Ye? Not for real. I mean, Drake, Ye influenced Drake. I feel like it was Lil so, Wayne. And then, it was Lil Wayne via L- Ye. Lil, yep, Wayne. Well, when Wayne he started I think Wayne the- started. Mm. Well, I don't know. I really well, don't know. Because I feel, like, I feel like Wayne started this shit when he met Drake. So it could have been Drake influenced. I don't know. Who, who knows who influenced who? Yeah. But yeah. Wayne was one of the first niggas that I heard do a whole rap verse. Yeah, mm, Lollipop came out. That did, changed the game. But I was going to say, uh, Wayne didn't come out doing that singing shit to Drake. Till Ye. I don't know, bro. Mm. <sighs> This the big three. Yeah. Yay, Drake and Wayne. My man Ryan says, so far, so gone, Drake was rapping, rapping. <laughs> He was, singing, um, he was singing his ass off. I'm going to have to say, Drake is in multiple big three conversations, too. Like, just on the best oh, okay. songs. Oh, yeah. And on some rap shit. Like, oh, yeah. That's got to be, you know. What I'm, I'm trying. I'm trying to hear the uh, the kid Maestro versus Luca debate because <laughs> right now you trying to hold down Drake and and, and Luca is not gonna let you hold down Drake, bro. Oh. <laughs> I, bro, I just want you to name what's your favorite future song that that got you so hyped. Mm. Yeah, you know what? You know what that, that's like, real. He never responded to that, bro. Yo, what's up with that? What's, what's, <laughs> <laughs> that's why I'm looking at Mad Cow. Like, I'm like, yo, what's up? <laughs> he never really responded. to He said, "Hold on, this man just said future, a second generation Dungeon family." Yeah, that's real, but like. Yo, what's your favorite? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> hey, my Jackson says, if Future redropped astronaut status, it'd be wild. Mm. Mm. Savia says, facts and Future never tried to Drake a song. Mm, that's sure tried to Drake a song. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hmm. Ghost has a question. He says, "What y'all think about Big Sean in this place? Let's go. Yeah, yeah. Let's have that discussion. Yeah, yeah. Let's have that discussion. Yeah. Big Sean, Ghost, man. Period. This, now that's a, that, let's talk about that. If we Period. say Big Four, yeah. Big Sean is definitely definitely number four. up there with one but, of them. Like but that he up can, there though. You know what I'm saying? But he definitely number he four. He may right not now. be up there right now, but he getting he's up there. Uh, this, I'm never gonna say this when we're AJ get back. Because <laughs> right I ain't never heard this shit that AJ said. LJ says he has no place. That's Damn. so crazy. Damn. He's Damn. under other. Damn. Oh. That's so crazy. Bro. Damn. That's how, how you, you know, feel. Fam, this is why I can't. Oh, hold oh, on. Oh, it's mad no, comments no, coming in. Hold on, hold on, hold on. It's mad comments coming like that, fam. So hold on. First of all, I think he responded. He said, oh my God, Maestro. That's the Taja guy. Let's go. Song? Huh? Oh my god. Oh my. God. I don't know. He, I don't know if that's if he shot out a future song or not. You know what I'm saying? I but thought he, he was oh shouting at me. Oh, so. oh my god. It's the <laughs> 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 then he says, "Shit, I forgot. I, I, I don't know if that refers to the song, John. I'm not sure. I mean, he um, did have a song called Shit. Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, oh, thought it was a drought. Tupac, throwaway, Puff and Zooties, just to name a couple. Those are the jumps that's better than Drake. Nah. Damn. All right. Hold on. He also says Big Sean is corny. Damn. <laughs> oh. Damn. Who said that? Whoa. That's Luca, man. Luca had these. Damn, these Luca having the, the most. <laughs> He, we, did, he, 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 did. Gotta, he gotta be on the show, bro. The next show yeah. gotta have you. Yeah. We gotta, we got gotta follow to, up, bro. Because these opinions is interesting, my <laughs> G. <laughs> Big Sean Corny. I feel like if. if he he mm. did have a punchline heavy corny run, but he kind of. Mm. He like he he came out of there. I feel like that was like his early, like. Mm. Okay, the oh my God was to Maestro saying that Drake is top three in multiple places. I mean, bro, fam. 
that's, that's how, how many of the rappers true. you look up to was artists of the decade. Mm. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, mm. how many of the artists that you know multiple on um, business and just making hits, and we in this top three rap conversation? That's what this whole conversation is about. He's in multiple top threes. This nigga beefing with Kendrick and Kanye, being compared to uh, uh, to Future in the street on like the fact that you bringing him up in terms of like talking to the streets or whatever. Like, it's what you say all the time. Like. If Jay Z is the one to be compared to, like that automatically makes him king. Absolutely. Drake's the one to beat in all of yeah. these conversations, yeah. except arguably the Kendrick Cole and Drake conversation. <laughs> people, would, a, lot, a lot of people say Kendrick is the one to beat. You right. know what I'm saying? Right. But he's still top three in multiple spaces. Yeah. yeah. But we not just going to only response to you like that though. Nah, nah. His only response to you is Drake is corny. And Sean is chips. You know what I'm saying? That's Damn. He, he, he son of you with three three word sentences. That's, you know what that's, that's the, uh, the <laughs> they collab album is uh, the Frio Lay Junk. Eating corn chips. Chili corn chips. Damn. Mm -hmm. Drake and Future. My man Jackson says Drake and Future had great songs on what what a time to be alive. I like that. Album. Yeah. I like that. Album. Um. Ghost says, what's crazy is Sean threw shots at all three of them the day before Kendrick just dropped. Folks stepped all over Sean Rollout. That's facts, bro. bro. It's sad as hell. Big Sean, best verse of his career was the Control <laughs> song. <laughs> was Control. Don't do that. And then Kendrick came in right after, and everybody only talk about, people think that's Kendrick's song, bro. <laughs> yeah. That's I mean, a big yeah. shot. I mean, song. Yeah, it is big shot. It is big shot. Oh, shit. It's a big shot. It's tough. This man stay getting these. <laughs> you talk about somebody getting caught up in the crossfire. Oh, man. <laughs> that's that. <laughs> that's Sean. I okay. Damn. I personally love. I man, Big Sean's album Detroit Two. Sheesh. Come on, bro. Yeah. Detroit I, Two is crazy. How you not find one song on that motherfucker? You not fucking. Yeah, that's bro. Crazy. And he was talking about real shit that was. Yeah. yeah. I, yeah. I, I, no, J Big Sean is dope. Now, you know, I don't know why everybody. Is mm. going in on him right now for having supposedly fake abs in his latest video, like the song cool. he just dropped. But you know what I'm saying? Sean? Uh, yeah, people saying his just was uh, uh, sketched in or implants. Mm. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bro. Are you fucking serious? Folks weren't even listening to his rap. Bro, that man was rapping, bro. And it's, <laughs> everything just gets over. Yeah, everything okay. just got overshadowed, bro. <laughs> Big Sean just be taking like L's when it comes to this rap giant, whether it be from other rappers or just like his <laughs> own video, bro. Else. The whole comment session section was just not about the verses that he dropped, bro. That man was spitting. But, sorry, no man. Deep. Big Sean coming back, bro. And honestly, shout out to Detroit too. But when I think of Detroit too, again, mm. big respect to Big Sean because Big Sean was killing it. But I think of Hit Boy more than anything. To me, like that was mm. like yeah. I, I I hear Hit Boy's Produce, the, the, the genius, the you know, his creativity all through that. Like the way I feel like that was like his jet to me. So yeah. <laughs> Man, Luca going in. Bro. Not fake abs. Oh my gosh. Luca says, Maestro. I can't even read this joke without laughing, bro. Luca says, again, You know what, though? Luca says, Maestro, you do realize Drake is a nigga that fights over married women, right? He's corny. <laughs> <laughs> he has brains, hey, extensions, and shit. Yeah, Damn, Maine is a target rapper, but respect. Damn, man. Yeah, most deaf. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. Oh, damn. <laughs> man, man, watching most deaf interviews, bro. <laughs> hey, um, I mean, he's all of those things, I guess, but he's still, <laughs> like, he's, he's like, what? he's still in the top three of these conversations. This is why Drake is an enigma, bro. That man can actually rap, bro, and like really do this shit. That's crazy, bro. You just can't take that away from him. You can oh, give you, him all these other things. Drake implant, Drake braids his implants? Or his stitches? I, 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 I they know. were at first, yes. Damn. That's what's I, uh, But then but, I mean, might have been extended. We don't know, man. <laughs> we don't know. What's his what's name? Name? Fetty, right? We don't know. Fetty, Wap. <laughs> Fetty Wap was one of the main ones they were talking about having dread yeah, like a Fetty Wap and who is a uh Stuggity flipping it? Who is that dude? Uh, uh, that's, uh, that's my uh, man. Snooty Wap. Snooty Wap. Snooty Wap. Snooty Wap. Snooty Wap. He definitely Snooty had Wap, something in there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah, we not we not even bringing up. Respect <laughs> we not even let's, right, let's talk about somebody else. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm a piece new to me for real. Uh -huh. 
That's that that stack of the flipper was my right, shit, bro. <laughs> that was my stuff. <laughs> <laughs> I had that shit on super loop. <laughs> yeah. Um, Sorry. let me see. LJ says Virgos. I'm sure I've listened to it, but again, I've never had any of his albums on repeat. Yo, LJ, you, 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 you hold on, bro. Like, I I know you. I think we need to sit and listen to Detroit too. Yeah, yeah. In that's the why studio, they say it hurts so much because like, yeah, I feel like, like you real. really should. Yeah, like Detroit too, like, specifically. Like. Definitely. That album is ridiculous. You know what I'm saying? The world. The production is, is crazy too, but Big Sean really went. He went yeah. Really yeah. Be because of Hit Boys. That man produced that job, bro. I hey, feel like it was. And, and I'm not taking away nothing from Big Sean. Did it? He wrote yeah. it, but I feel like it was definitely in them situation. You know how Kanye be bringing out yeah. the best. Nah, I feel like Hit Boy was really yeah, on you, that. If you go to his, if you go to Detroit, like if you go to any of the other albums, they that was the one. But I feel like because of that, the run, the, the camaraderie they had built up until that point, I think that was definitely a part of it. All right, man. We, you know, they still going in, bro. So, uh, Lucas says Drake has Ghost Riders, bro. Mm. Wow, this was and a big. Does. This was a big. Mm. This and does. Not, okay. This does. <laughs> to be fair, these this might. Crazy, bro. These might. This might put a stain because Drake writes, and you don't know if he wrote it. You mm. know that he is capable. You know he's an amazing writer. But now we don't know who we hearing. That is. That is a problem. Mm. Even looking at first you can never be totally sure like no more. Twelve people on the record. That's facts. You can never be totally sure no more. That's we still facts. know this now. Damn, I'm not even gonna say that. All right. Yeah. Well, uh, we did not get to no other topics, and it has <laughs> been the complete time of <laughs> of uh, of tight beat. Uh, what you guys want to do? Man, we just have to save them topics for next time, bro. <laughs> <laughs> we not gonna listen to uh, no underground AF. I know uh, Unique got some flips. Oh uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Shout out to all the producers that sent in their flips um, to my vocal sample that I released in the app, the Unapologetic World app. This past Saturday, <laughs> what happened? <laughs> <laughs> bro, Luca got me dying. Um, Man, comment is just, bro, maestro. Look, bro, Drake, not that. Trust me. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. If you rap good enough, you can win. Push your T show that. So, you know. You know so, what I'm saying? But push your T is not in them conversations. No, but you know what I'm saying? Like, it's just, it is what it is. All the city jumps is hard. All the, you know what I'm saying? The city in a certain time. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. The city time joints is down. The city I, time I'm with you. I, I'm, I'm on Drake shit. Pause. For some. <laughs> I, I, I do fuck with Luca like with no facts. It's just going in. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Man, said okay, future. So that I'm was definitely a, the, the bait joint. Man, said future, bro. And then Google some future songs. When we asked him. <laughs> we asked him which ones he liked, bro. Man, I'm just man. You came with with, with dates, facts, Wikipedia page. My man said, Luke said no. It, man. <laughs> Luke <laughs> said no. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> all that Wikipedia. Yeah, shit. fuck all that. He's shit. not that. Bro. I know Trust a real me. nigga when I see one, and he is not him. <laughs> I do fuck with him. Uh, yeah. Uh, it's tough. Like, if anybody, if, if anybody brings up, hold on, bro. Lucas said, "Tell Maestro check his phone, bro. That may send you specific." <laughs> 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 yeah, what are you say it, bro? Uh, Drake, Corny, G, trust me. <laughs> <laughs> Damn, <laughs> yo. <laughs> He had to get he, oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> And period. <laughs> <laughs> the on the live stream. Yo, you know what, Luca? I respect that, bro. <laughs> you still he wrong, said, my G. You know what I'm saying? He had to get personal. You still period. wrong, man. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, try it again. <laughs> That's what's up, man. Oh, yeah, you sent us something through? Yeah, I said, uh, okay, just bad. one of them. I want to just share just one of them. Uh, shout out to Alejandro. <laughs> oh, yeah, shout out Alejandro. Uh, yo, this man, he's uh, he's from, dang, where is he from? He's from Jersey. Mm. Um, but uh, my man Da Vinci, you know, has brought him on and started training him in the ways of playback okay. from his hill. So he's definitely part of the team. But he, and as a producer, he's crazy in his own mm-hmm. right. Mm-hmm. Young he's dude crazy. going in. So, yeah, man, shout out you if you're seeing this. Period. Salute. This jump was hard. You did your thing. Okay, so it's time to play it? Oh, yeah. All right, let's do it. Oh, damn.
Just wanted to say goodbye. Y'all keep them coming. Another one will be dropped today. Be on the lookout. Yeah, with that being said, uh, all of that is provided exclusively in the Unapologetic World app for iOS and Android devices. It is free. Um, Man, so much is in there. Not just our stuff, but the whole world stuff. We got people submitting music from Australia, from Norway, from places I can't even pronounce. uh, And we have names I can't even pronounce. Uh, but uh, yeah, the, the Unapologetic World app is a great place to not just find uh, people being boldly and unapologetically themselves, um, but new music, short films, interesting discussions, stuff like this. Right now, this is live in the app, you know what I'm saying? So um, yeah, come check us out, man. It's free. Just check your app store, put in Unapologetic World. And uh, yeah, any last words on this debate? Damn, K. Dot. <laughs> <laughs> We'll see what we'll see what happens next, okay? This was up. Okay. <laughs> Indeed. Yo, you got yeah, the flip got mad love, by the way. A whole bunch of people shouting it out. So Oh, period, period. Yeah, shout yeah. out to Alejandro, man. He yeah, kept yeah, that shit, yeah. Man. Big shout out for y'all for everybody in the chat. Everybody chiming in. Big shout out to everybody who partook in the debate. I love that. Um <laughs> Luca, 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 bro, you gotta pull up, bro. Yeah, like, this, this. <laughs> we gonna listen Stand to some people. Yeah, you gotta pull up, bro. <laughs> and we gonna break down the lyrics. <laughs> Absolutely. Y'all, he yeah. probably on the way right now. <laughs> <laughs> he was probably texting and driving. <laughs> Mace said, check your phone. <laughs> Mace said, oh, said, open the front door, bro. I'm, I'm here now. <laughs> Yo, he would have pulled up, bro. Yo, that would have be been epic. That would have been epic for sure. Um, but yeah, yeah, yeah. Another episode of Tight Beat. Lucas said he'll be there. Y'all, it's recorded. Here he said he'll, he'll come through. Um, yeah, so we do this every every Saturday, uh, two o'clock CST. Lock in with us. You can uh, revisit episodes on YouTube and also on the Unapologetic World app. This has been Tight Beat. My name is I Make Mad Beats, and my cast unique. Period. C major, Kid Maestro, and we out. Y'all stay dangerous. Oh, damn. Damn. Y'all stay dangerous. Stay safe. Do both or do neither. Peace.
Are you jealous? Oh shit, here we go again.